What's more impressive for you, Toronto's 14-game point streak or Mitch Marner's 22-game point streak? Um, to me, the team point streak's more impressive right now. Um, this team, I know they've had some success in the regular season, and this isn't anything real different. But to me, it is It is a little bit different. It's the manner in their winning. Uh, it's a collective effort. It's kind of that team defense thing that, that this team's been lacking. They've got the goaltending. It's just, it's just a more impressive thing. It takes more moving parts to fall into place to get a, a team uh, point streak going on like that where a guy like Mitch Marner or, or you know take your pick and one of the stars on that team can go on on these point streaks and get hot albeit this point streak by Marner is especially long and especially impressive but I mean if you got to pick one I'll take the team one but there's no question both of these uh both of these streaks are impressive and uh hopefully they just keep going on and on and on could not agree more, and I'm going to side with you. I think the team point streak is more impressive just because of the longevity of it. To go 14 games without a regulation loss, I think, is pretty impeccable in this day and age specifically where it doesn't matter who you play. It could be Anaheim. It could be Seattle. It can be Tampa. Every game, for the most part, is going to be a difficult one to play in this league. So I think it really shows the consistency and the longevity of this Maple Leafs team. So I think the team record, uh, that's really, really impressive to go 14 in a row. And I think in addition to that, I don't, I don't have the numbers in front of me, but they've gone like a bunch of games past 20, I believe, where they've notched at least a point out of like 22. Like it's only been a couple games. So they're notching points like every night is what I'm trying to say. And to me, just to have that night in and night out, I think it's really, really hard. I mean, you played in this league to have the consistency. That, that's tough and over an 82 game slate. You're not always going to have it, right? Yeah, it is. And uh, I mean, especially I've, you know, I've touched on it before. It's different playing in Toronto. You got that market where yeah, when at, like, you know, you're in Florida, you can go on that little bit of a tear where you just keep, you know, you get, you know, your head in the sand and all of a sudden you look up and man, we're really rolling, aren't we? But in Toronto, it's every single game, every period is dissected, dissected. And it seems like it's so long and and to go on a huge run with all the things being written about it and people taking their takes on your team this year and this is only because of this and this is only because of that and well yeah what they're lacking this and every day more questions questions media people they want to write their columns and it's just never ending and you're always on the spot when you're playing for that team and it's impossible just to kind of put the blinders on and just start rolling it seems like but this group is doing it and I think that makes it you know, a little bit more special that, uh, you know, they're, they're going to get the scrutiny. They're going to get the criticism. They're still the group that hasn't gotten it done in the playoffs. And um, it seems like they're not caring about that whatsoever. They don't seem to have any demons or skeletons in the closet right now. I know it's not playoff time, but this just seems uh, like they're putting it together in a way that everyone's been asking for for a long time here. Yeah, the key part in that right now. Just wait till the springtime. I can't wait for this. Maybe I'll fly out to Calgary with you and we'll watch the games together and then we'll bask in the <laughs> glory of those uh, those games because, man, it's a tough time, the springtime, when you talk to yours truly. But again, let's enjoy the ride before we get to that turbulence and that roller coaster.